Hi everyone and welcome to my channel, uh, Nicola's Stitching and Colouring Corner. Um, I love these books. They're coloured by numbers. Um, this one is Fairies by David Woodroth and they are um, published by Arcturus Publishing. Um, I've got many of these books which I'll do videos of in the future. But I just want to do this quick flip through for you. Um, on the inside cover you have samples of what they will look like finished. And you can also colour in these ones on the front title page. This edition published in 2021 by Arcturus Publishing Limited. And I believe that the American version is published by Sirius. Um, but I think they have the exact same images inside. So the numbers in these are small. I think you do get large number, uh, large print ones with bigger numbers. So if you are um, hard of sight, um, then the large print ones are easier. Paper is good quality. It's not it's not thin, it's not thick, but you could use a variety of mediums on it. I wouldn't go for some paints, might not work. Um, I tend to use Statler Tri Plus Fine Liners and Fiber Tips. Um, I do have other pens, I prefer pens. Although I do have a set of Brute Funer pencils, which I needed to use more of. I mean, the details in these are amazing. You would need fine liners for them if you were using pens. I love doing the intricate bits. Started this one, which was the one on the front cover. Um, we'll go back to that at some point and finish her off. Behave yourself. Apologies in advance, this is my very first video that I've ever done on YouTube, so... <laughs> I'm actually more of a nature, animals, um, I have a lot of Millie Marotta books. Um, but the, the fairies book just appealed to me for some reason. Look at that face. <laughs> I believe there is another one in the set, um, Enchanted World, which I don't have. Which would also be in the fantasy genre. In these books. I love this one, Underwater. I think they do little tadpoles as well. You do get some that are 
just for ease of doing this video I'm not going to turn them around but you do get a lot of ones that are um, portrait rather than landscape I mean these are all amazing images hanging out or washing Boy fairies on a toadstool singing. Ah, worshipping the sunflower. Worshipping the sun. Talking to a sparrow. It's raining. Hmm. God, I can't wait to colour these. David Woodroff um, does a lot of these books. Um, Twinkle, twinkle, little star. And this is the other set of finished designs. Um, and then you have your colour key at this end, which is quite useful um, to have as a cut. You could cut that out if you wanted, or I just leave it there. Um, as I say, I, I usually use Statler um, fine liners and fibre tips. Um, and I will match as I go along a number with little stickers um, onto the pens, the colours, and just keep them separate um, in a separate um, Tupperware box um, for these um, books. Uh, I had just bought a new book recently um, and it is the Calm Colour by Numbers. And the colour key, normally these are all the same, but the one in that one is different. So yesterday I went through them all and another set of pens <laughs> and numbered them all and they are now in a separate pencil case for that book. So I'm always buying more and more colouring supplies, but then... Uh, I will also be doing videos of my cross stitch projects um, in the future um, and of course my colouring books but this is the first video for just now so I hope you liked and uh, I'll be back again soon. Bye!